Hello, this is Kirill from forexboat.com and welcome to the first tutorial in the course on setting up your virtual private server for reliable forex trading. I'm very excited to have you on this course and I truly believe in what I want to teach you in this course. I think it can make your forex trading more reliable and safe and um, uh, prevent uh, uh, substantial losses. So I'm very uh, happy to share this information with you. So we will start this course by discussing what is a virtual private server. And if you've never even considered uh, using a virtual private server before, then not a not a worry. Um, have a look at this tutorial, and uh, possibly this will convince you that a virtual private server is the way to go with uh, algorithmic forex trading. So what is a virtual private server? Um, let's uh, look at uh, the basic scenario where you have a computer and you're using your Forex robots uh, to trade through your broker on the Forex market and obviously you're um, earning some profits from this activity. And uh, maybe you've uh, purchased some Forex robots or maybe uh, you always had a strategy and you've just implemented it or uh, had somebody else implement it for you as a Forex robot and now you've started using um, this um, expert advisor in your MetaTrader 4 terminal. So what a virtual private server is, it's it's basically a computer, another computer somewhere else in the world. It can be ne next to you, it can be on the other side of the world in a different country. But uh, essentially it's another computer somewhere else which you can hire, which you can rent out for a, a fee. Uh, for example, it can be $20 a month, it can be $150 a month, depending on uh, your setup. You would use this computer to set up your Forex robots and MetaTrader 4 terminals on that virtual private server and for them to trade from there. And the dashed line represents you just basically doing the initial setup and checking in once in a while to see how your Forex robots are going. The two uh, orange lines show that uh, your Forex robots just continue trading on the Forex market without you even having to bother about them. And that's the essence of the PPS to take you out of the equation for you to be completely free and for your computer to be free at the same time for uh, the trading to continue and for uh, you to keep earning a profit. So what? why would you use a virtual private server? What are the advantages? Well, uh, there are some obvious advantages of using a, a virtual private server. Uh, first of all, it works 24-7, so uh, it's always um, hard to keep your computer on 24-7. It might be noisy, it might overheat, it might um, you might be um, concerned leaving it on when you're going away because uh, you never know if something might uh, malfunction uh, on the computer while it's at home. Especially now uh, nowadays, a lot of people have laptops, they're very compact and they're easy to carry around, but they're much harder to keep on all the time because if you're taking it with you somewhere, then you have to switch it off or at least put it to sleep. Or if you want to leave it on, and I try this, believe me, if you want to leave it on for uh, weeks and weeks, then it will start overheating because it's so, everything's so small there and the cooling system isn't as great as in uh, big computers. So what else? Um, your a virtual private server will free up your personal computer. So uh, you'll be able to not only uh, switch it off when you like, but you'll also be able to use the f fully the resources of your personal computer. And when a MetaTrader 4 uh, terminal has uh, some expert advisors running in it, it can use up, up substantial resources like up approximately maybe 200, 300 megabytes per terminal when there's quite a few expert advisors trading in it. So uh, you get you get those resources back and do your you know um, video editing or just leisure activities and um, don't have to worry about uh, the MetaTrader 4 terminals anymore. A Forex uh, VPS is accessible from anywhere. So you can access it from work if you want to, you can access it from your laptop, you can access it from a friend's home. And in this um, course, you will see how easy it is to quickly set up access to your VPS. And uh, basically you can monitor your robots wherever you are. Unlike with a home computer, you can only do that when you get home and you're sitting in front of the computer. Also, a uh, virtual private server has a reliable power supply and connection to the internet. Basically, this means that your virtual private server provider will do everything they can to make sure your computer is, always has uh, electricity, so it's working, and it always has a connection to the internet. Statistically, it's more likely for you to have a power disruption or an internet connection failure at home than it is on your provider's side. 
Uh, having said that, providers do sometimes have uh, scheduled ma maintenance, which they will warn you about. That will cause the restart of your server, but that's something that we address in this course and we learn how to deal with those little um, prices that you have to pay for having such a convenient tool as a virtual private server. And finally, a uh, virtual private server is easily scalable to your needs. So if you uh, have a computer at home, it might have a limited amount of RAM or uh, physical uh, memory or bandwidth or um, uh, CPU power. But if you uh, hire out a virtual private server for your forex trading, then you can always adjust that. And if you uh, decide to deploy more robots or um, increase uh, the number of accounts you're trading on, then you can always uh, request uh, your virtual private server to be allocated more resources. And that can be done even without switching off your virtual private server. It is a very simple process that uh, your provider can do for you. Those are the main reasons for using a virtual private server for your Forex trading. And from personal experience, since I started using a VPS, I've never looked back and it's definitely been a major game changer for me. Let me know if you have any questions and I look forward to seeing you on the next tutorial. Until then, happy trading.